everybody. Good buddy Kyo here with Dignified again. Yeah, and we're back with no tomato Haru no ride. I keep forgetting the Haru. And last we left off, we met Alvarez. Yeah. After Antonio's been gone for a goddamn year. The poor beb. Anyway, we go. Hello, lady. Wait. Books of many colors. A particular book stands out. Run to know deep within by Chibi Anime Freak. The book seems really interesting. I should give it a read sometime. Yeah, I remember them saying that they stuck up quite a bit of like fan fiction stuff in there. The yeah. notice board by Happy Moon. Like, and I never read fan fiction, so And and I read a lot of fan fiction, but it's been a really long time since I've like been properly into uh Spamano, so like I wouldn't recognize a lot of big names. Yeah, kicking the bucket list. Meanwhile, I make um Germany centric ones. Not all the time. I made a America centric one recently. Mm -hmm. Um, all or nothing. I really need to do it on that one. I need a I need to update Shonen Lost. Jesus Christ. Yes. Yes. I we we need to update Shonen because that that fucking. That fic. You saw the... Yep. Anyway. Hello, lady! Hello! Welcome to the post office! Would you like to send anything out? We offer the fastest delivery service, even faster than USPS! Uh... Yes, I'd like to send this book, or manual script, to a publishing company. Certainly, sir! And which publishing company would you like to send this to? I'd like to send it to Kawaii Dream! <laughs> because we're getting weeb up in this shit. Alright, well, we'll be sure to mail it to them ASAP! Thank you for your time! Thank you, Bella. Wink wonk! I'll get my dojin published someday! <laughs> Alright, I can only hope the company accepts my book. Let's walk. Behind. Yeah. Let's look at this shit. We run the post office now. Any bonus? Any bonus? Any bonus? Any bonus? Let's talk to this person. Oh, I will voice this small child. Yeah, I was about to say, is this a child? Looks like a child. I'm working on something right now. Please don't disturb me. You're even not supposed to be behind this desk, stupid. Who the fuck are you calling stupid little piss baby? Me. I am. You're calling yourself stupid? I'm calling you stupid! Yeah, you are stupid! I got you! Alright, time to go home. I'm tired as fuck. I'm gonna talk to these two first. Yeah! Hello! I am going out for a nice walk in nature. rudwig san told me it, it's good to keep exercise up, so the sorted fish I eat do not harm my hairs. Good job. I do as he says, because I would do anything to keep eating sorted fish. Good job, Beb. Hello. Like you can do it. I was about to say I like. You're pretty good at it. Oh, thank. You're I've a lot better been... than I am. Oh, baby. Have you seen my big brother? Brother. What? Why can't I say that word in a Russian accent today? If not, then get out of my way. Rude. Uh, this way? No. Nah. Back and forth. What's this? Yeah. Ah! I can walk on the moss! Okay. Signs. <laughs> <laughs> flowers? Nope. Yeah, step in the flowers. <laughs> Lavino don't give a fuck. <laughs> Where you go? Ah. Hello. Shit! I didn't mean to say that out loud! An exclamation? Yeah. Hello? D don't get the wrong idea! Or anything, bastard! I'm not following you or some shit like that. My home just happens to be this way. Okay. Goodbye. Of course I have to go the same way as that guy, of fucking course. Guess, it guess I can't help it. I'd better keep moving. You're not gonna ever ask him about what happened, because if they are related, then, you know, you can actually get some info out of him. <laughs> I 
Th that place is... Could he... Really be... I've got to follow him and make sure. Do you live in that abandoned place, sir? Hello? There you are. Talk to him. And... Antonio. No. No, actually, I'm Alvarez. Oh, uh, sorry, I seem to have mistaken you for someone else. Mm. It came down pretty suddenly, huh? Ah! <gasps> what if Antonio was never? What if oh, he God. never made it? Yeah, what? What if there? What if? Oh God, no! What if it was always all for us? It was always him. Oh no! I thought you just say to me. <laughs> then you're in air, Antonio. You bastard! <laughs> you, you don't know how much I've missed you. Damn it! Lo siento, Lovi. I'm back. <laughs> there, there. Pat, pat. Don't do fucking shush pat me. I'll do whatever I want. This is the end of the demo of Tomato Heart on the Ride. Thank you for playing the Take a Time Play. This means a lot to me. It would be kind enough to leave a comment or some feedback. The full chapter should be out in a week or less. Uh, but this has been out for a while. Hmm. Yes. Would you like to save your game? Yeah. Right there. Now, here are the credits. Look at them cute fuckers. Yeah. But, oh man. <gasps> He's so, back! So, that sort of leaves us with a bunch of questions. Like, uh, was it like you said? How, like, what if Antonio never actually made it back from the war so the person we were talking to and, you know, met in the abandoned building Maybe he's was split Alvarez? That's possible, too. Or maybe he, like, left the war. Maybe he's, like, desertion, so he had to go under a new persona and shit. Yeah, so, like, the question sort of becomes, like, is this Alvarez pretending to be Antonio, or Antonio pretending to be Alvarez, or were they always the same person, or what? Ah, it's all so crazy! I want to know, and there's rocks at the window. Yes, apologies for any external noises. Yes. It's so crazy, I'm so excited! Yeah. Like, uh, I, I really want to see where this goes. <laughs> Me too. Because it's like, now he's dating Alfred! Yeah! And where has he been? Yeah! Sabu! Yeah, okay. So, like... Now we need to go back and see how Prue Mano date. Yeah, see, yeah, see what happens if we say yes to Prussia's offer for a date. Yeah, yeah. And then after that, I think it would be interesting to see what happens if we say yes, yes. to Alfred. Yes. Because, like, is it any different than if we said no to both and we still just end up with him anyway after yeah. a year later? Or is there some difference? So we'll have to try and see. Find out. Yes. Yes. Yep, now we start at the beginning. Okie dokie, so file one. Let's go back. Yeah, you did. Let's go buy some shit. Yeah. At the pub. Pub, 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 pub go. This time, just, just for the sake of... Knowing that we've done everything we can, let's not spend all of our money on tomatoes and beer. Granted, it won't even matter. Because he's not going to show up anyway. Well, you don't know that. We might need it to show later on. Yeah, so we're going to skip this part because so, we already did this part. Yeah, so... So how about it? you, me, dinner? Yes. Give it the is at your service, Govino. Yes. You're an asshole, but... I'll fucking think about it, damn it. Just stop complimenting yourself every single sentence. It's really annoying. It's getting really annoying, you fuck. 
Yes, 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 yes. I knew you'd say yes. I'd say something about myself being awesome, but I'd refrain from doing so just because you asked me to. Ah. Yeah, whatever, bastard. You show me what you actually have. D you know, in your shop, not in your pants. Of course, go right ahead. I even gave you a special discount, so be thankful. Yeah, yeah, I'm thankful as fuck. Bye. You gave me no discount, you uh -huh. hoe. I'm gonna buy one. And one German beer, just in case. Yes. Only one. Okay. We done. Come back and talk to me anytime you want to go for a good one. That's it, that's it. Fine. Yes. Hey, I'll be looking toward for our mess next meeting then. I guess so, bastard. See you around sometime. Yes, right back at ya, Lovino. Alright, it's got one in it. So, let's go. Uh, what you do? Oh, right. Save, save it on the first one. But. What? I was. I, I thought that, like, when we tried to. Well, I have to do another these... one for America that's untouched right here. Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay. Never mind. Yeah, this is just the Gilbert file. Yeah, okay. Part of me wonders what happens if I say yes to America, too. We'll do that after we try each individually. So, yeah. We go, we say no, we buy the jacket, and then we go and be disappointed. Yep. I don't care. I don't care. care. I know, I'm done. Because they give an up top thing before, yeah. Go say no? Nah. nah. It's okay, I'm just in the fucking friend zone, even though I end up with you anyway. We got it! Yeah. Emerald green. Just like the color of Antonio's eyes. <laughs> I truly <laughs> am <laughs> jealous, but I own it now. Buy this bitch! Okie dokie. Now we just head up north. That means I have to battle and shit! Yeah. No! Well, at least you know that you can, like, escape from. Escape! Some. Yep. So, yeah, just like. Oh man, mystery. So much. I'm excited, I want to see what happens. Because maybe in the one year later we end up with Gilbert. Yeah, because like, like it, it could work to just sort of switch it around where instead of working at Gilbert's place and dating Alfred, what if we're working at Alfred's place and dating Gilbert? Yeah. Or, or something else, I don't know. Because then I wonder, like, if that, that, I don't know, not, not that way. If that's the case, then the thing would still be the same, even if we did say yes to America. But I still want to say I want to still want to see what it says when I say yes. Yeah. Could be so happy. Give. Oh damn it. <laughs> Guess what? I don't give a shit. Surprise. <sighs> Fucking forest. With the counter rate so up. Goddamn. Why am I going? Oh yeah, that's right. No. No! I don't care about your fucking spiders. No! Whose idea was this? Probably the creators. Yeah, like... Just... What, like, what, what, what would you say about... Well, I guess... I could phrase this question differently. Like, what are your thoughts on, like, a good encounter rate? Like, stuff. I don't know. Less than this. Because, <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know. Because, like, for small maps, yeah, that's a good idea. For huge maps, this is getting frustrating. Especially when there's a... Ga damn it, I went the wrong way again. When there's mazes. Like, Escape in Siberia had a good uh, random encounter rate. Mm. Not this one, though. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because I... Bats! I don't... Bats. I'm gonna punch some bats if I ever <laughs> see bats again. Yeah, I don't know anything about making no-vidja games, so... <laughs> you could try. 
I could, I could, though. My interest is always lie more in uh, visual novels than RPGs. Yeah. Could make one. I could, I could. Bats! I'm gonna fight them! Punch them! I'm gonna punch this bat! Yeah! Yeah! Hardcore hit the bat! Yeah! I punched a bat for you, Gilbert! Be grateful. No spiders. But I have not seen bees yet. There's the bees! Yeah. Fuck off, bees. We're almost out. Almost. Bees! Nope. Oh, there it is! Got my way! Yes! No! Yes! So tell us, if you were to make a visual novel, what would you make it of? I honestly... I'm gonna touch the sheep. Don't know. Yeah, fuck the sheep. <laughs> she wanted to touch the sheep again. Yes! Sheep's important to me. Ah. But, yeah, like, I don't really know. Like... I, like, I have always thought it would be neat to make a Heta game just to, you know, contribute to that whole situation. I don't know what to call it. Situation? Like, my situation, or just it in general, like just, a fad, or... Just in general, like the phenomenon, I suppose, might yeah. be a better word for it. Just because, you know, Heta games are a thing. Yep. It's especially gotten a lot more popular in recent years. Yeah, yeah. All because of Hitoni and shit. Yeah, yeah. Phenomenomicon. There he left. Going right. Wait, why are you going in file four? I, I guess I can go in. Yeah, I thought file. Yeah, because I thought is the said file count? one was okay, we the go. Gilbert file. Okay, it's that whole blood, of blood blue. Gilbert pub. One now year later. let's see if anything's different. Here it passed, yada yada. Hello. Sensor moving on. Change the lot. Date him. Cry Date. Lot. Say it. Stop it. Cry, booby. Cry, booby. Start no. working at Gilbert's place. Heart. Mm. It doesn't look like it's gonna be different. Well, Let's let's just see. Benefit of the doubt. Yeah. Okay, so still left in the book. Just rejected. Yep. Yep. Up. 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 And yep. Okay. Same thing. So it's just the same thing. Alright. Yeah. Yeah. But we can still at least say uh, yes to America to see his reaction. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Though it, it would be neat if, like, in some future update there was something to at least acknowledge if you chose to date. Uh, One or the other. Yeah. Hi, Bubby! I'm flirting with you, hardcore! Wanna hug? I can't, because I'm confined in here. Canada says so. Okay, would you like to go out with me, Lavina? Sure, bastard. But don't expect much from me, okay? I'm not anyone special. But if you really feel that way, then I accept. Besides, that was actually really nice of you to say. Damn it. Really? Great! And hey, aren't I usually nice to you? A hero is gonna be nice to everyone they meet because they fight evil. There's a difference between being nice to everyone and being especially nice to the one you like, Ali. Alfred. Ali! Yeah, really. And I guess so. Uh, anyways, show me some of your jackets. I'm buying one for someone. Aren't you the busy bee, Lovie? 
You got it! I can't buy shit. Nope. Hey, Lovino, next time you come back, I'll give you my jacket. Then we can go on a date to the amusement park. It'll be super fun, dude. Ah. Bastard, don't say it out loud like that. It's embarrassing as fuck. But I would like that very much so. Thanks, Alfred. No problem, man. See you later. So I've got a new jack for Antonio. Yeah. Okay. Say anything. Come back soon. Okay. Then that's about it for us. Yeah. Banjo. Sorry. <laughs> Let's go somewhere that's not Banjo. No! Oh. We are trapped here. Oh well. That's well. fitting, I guess, that we end things with our date. Very happy homo Alfred. I like our Alfred. <laughs> I hope you don't- My version of him is really annoying and I'm apologize to people. And I'm sorry for you having to put up with him the most. It's okay. Yes. Oh, you have a way out if you want to get out of the banjo zone. Nah. <laughs> let's- let's stay. Okay. With our bay. So yes, that's um, made a hard no ride so far. I'm definitely 100% up for the update. Though yes. I don't know. Like, if it is soon, then I'll be able to have Dig here, but I'm not going to play the rest of it without Dig here. Because this is a special moment Aww. for us. And it's like we love our homo games. I wish there was more of it. Yeah, it's, it's, it's always fun to see, like, a game that is just, like, fully embracing of, like, a given ship. Like that, you know, doesn't hold back on the romance. Because there are a lot of games where it's just sort of like... Ship tease. Yeah, various ships are, you know, hinted at a little. But it's it's good to see games that are just like, yeah, this is a romance. We're committing to that. Yeah. American Banjo. <laughs> Boo the comp. Shut up. And Alfred finally got his hugs. Yeah. He got his... Booby from his did, now did, did baby. you call Romano a booby? <laughs> no, I was, I was cutesy saying baby. But it came out as booby. Shh. <laughs> Hush! I do what I want, I'm the hero. I'm the hero here. Now I wanna make a game about this. Wait, about what? Homo Alfred. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, that that would be something. Have him as the main character. Yeah, that would be a horrible parody of like so many games. It would like that. Like the the question would be like, would you want to go into it with the idea that like, you know, our main character is this Alfred who's like super duper friendly and always flirting and like wants physical contact with everyone, and like, I think sort of. How the game would go would come from how others reacted to it. Because, like, would you want it to be, like, everyone else is just like, what, 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 the f why are you, why are you all over me? What's going on? Or, like, His quest for hugs. <laughs> yes. <laughs> he needs that special someone. <laughs> <laughs> Canada's like, no. You know what? No. Get out. He has to move out. Oh, that's that's how the game would start. <laughs> Canada kicks him out of the house. Because he's so fucking done with his bullshit. Yeah, so he's just going You're looking for some- You're a goddamn grown-ass man. If you want hugs, go find it from someone else, not me. I'm not into that. And so he goes on his quest for hugs and somewhere new to live. <laughs> he tries England, but something- Like, England's his target, but everything keeps getting in the way. And then he finds love somewhere else. Yeah. I'm sorry, we're just rambling on at this point. It yeah, just sounds really funny. It does. But yeah, just... I like how he's a character of just us making fun of games, and now he's just a character that we both like to reference. Yeah. Because he's special in his own way. He is. Like, he he has a good heart. Yeah, he tries. He's like, he's like a puppy. Yeah, that's that's a really good like comparison Lily. to draw. 
He's he's just a little puppy that wants to show so much love in the only way he knows how. But he's really big and beefy, so when he tries, he knocks you all over and gives you bruises. Yep. That's him. That's our man. That's our guy. Blessed be to hopefully he'll one day get his love and a hug. But yes. right now we can't hug him. Yes. Anyway. We've been on here for too long. But hey, full episode. Yeah. Yay. So that's about it for us. So have a good day, everybody. Bye. Bye. Yeah.